So for my TS-80P, recently um, it was not um, operating correctly, and it was saying no tip was uh, being found in the, um, the base unit. So um, I ordered a, uh, a new tip here and was still seeing that I was having some issues, so I figured out what was going on here, so thought I would uh, make a little video of it. And uh, so... Um, what you can do is uh, get yourself uh, an ohmmeter and um, probably won't be able to measure this too easily here. So I, cl <clears throat> I clipped on uh, wires um, going to the uh, ohmmeter here and um, basically uh, the ohmmeter is about 6 ohms uh, for the uh, older tip and then I'll measure the newer one. So the newer one's clipped in there, and um, it's also around 6 ohms. So the old one and the new one are identical, so there must be something in this black base unit that's not working too nicely. So if I put the uh, tip into this unit and uh, try to start it up here, push it a couple times, it says no tip. And I push this uh, tip in as far as it can go and um, push the start, no tip. So um, here's what I found out. If you take the shield and unscrew it a little bit, you'll see that um, there's a little bit of uh, thread gap here now. Um, what that's going to allow, if you unscrew this, that gap gets wider and wider. So what happens is when you plug this tip into the base unit um, and you put a little gap there, the, um, the bottom insertion point goes deeper into the connector, into this uh, black handle, and then it starts working correctly. So I've got a nice little gap here on my shield. I'm going to insert it and hit the start button. We'll see what happens. Okay, I just put it in there. There's still that little gap up there. If I push down on it, see it starts up nicely. So that's how I was able to get mine to work again. Uh, kind of frustrating, but I'm glad that I found out a little trick that you uh, need for this uh, soldering iron. Thanks. And here you can see there's the uh, the gap that I had that uh, gets the unit working. Um, I could probably make the gap smaller and it'd still work, but I just wanted to show you for demonstration purposes.